Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 25. It's Christmas Day. Merry Christmas to everyone who celebrates. I'm just about to head out to go get crepes because I called the place and they're open. It's like four o'clock, I think. I don't know, but I'm gonna do that. And then I might meet up with Jenna and her parents later, but I wanna like walk around the Louvre area, but honestly, I have nothing else planned. So I'm just gonna like wander around the city and just try and find something that's open or to do, I don't know. I also want to check if a place is open for dinner because I want to get like a nice Christmas dinner out maybe. So I'm currently playing a Christmas movie. So that's what you hear in the background. But yeah, I'm going to kind of see what's open. The crepe place is near like the Notre Dame area. So I'm going to do that and then like walk over to the Louvre. So I will see you guys when I get to the crepe place. Hey you guys, so I just finished at the crepe place, but it was so busy that I did not film. Um, but I'm just gonna walk around now. I thought I was gonna meet Jenna and her parents, but I think I'm just gonna go home and watch Christmas movies. And then, yeah, but I'm gonna talk to my mom on the phone because I got her a gift from my friend. I had my friend commission like a piece of uh, art, but it's like on an ornament and it's a picture of my dogs. So I'm excited for her to open that. So I'm gonna FaceTime her uh, in like 10 minutes and have her open that. You guys, I made it to the area that I think the ice skating rink is at. I think that's it there, but this used to be in September, there was like an acrobat show on the roof and stuff um, for like one weekend. But yeah, I think this is the ice skating rink. It is the ice skating rink. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I wonder why it's closed though. It's, I mean, it is Christmas, but like, you think like an event like this would be open on Christmas, but it's so cute. I haven't seen an ice rink in so long, but it's in a very cute area. I think to get a booking though for this skating rink, it's very difficult um because it's like next to a hotel or something i don't know and there's like some sort of rule where you have to like buy something from the hotel i think i'm not really sure okay you guys so i found this cafe that i wanted to eat at and i got carbonara i was just facetiming Brittany, so i didn't film it when i first got it but it's actually very good so i guess it's here so i'm just walking to the Louvre park i went and had the linguine and i bought Tuck bar and now I'm gonna go sit at the loop and eat some. So I'll show you guys when we get there. So this is a place me and Jenna love to come and sit. Especially in the summertime we would come and just sit here because of these little benches um, on the like I don't know in dents of the Louvre and it's just such a nice place to sit and there's like benches literally all around the whole Louvre. So I'm gonna sit here and eat my chocolate and buy it. the Eiffel Tower and people watch. That's another reason we came is to people watch. A lot of the time it's fun to watch people take like the classic picture of them holding the point of that. It's fun. But I personally like the Louvre at night because it's so much prettier in pictures. Even the pictures that you take holding the, like doing this, it's so much prettier at night. So I don't know, this is my opinion, but in the daytime you can't get as good of a picture because it's all lit up so you can really see it. Something that's interesting is um, like back in Canada, there's not like a lot of places open on Christmas. Like I would say, like the big chains are. So, but here they're like, all, like there's a bunch of cafes that are open. I mean, I would say, no, I wouldn't say like every single one of them are open, but most of them are. And like, there's some grocery stores still open, and it's like 7 p.m. I think. So, but it's so weird. Like all the friends that I've made from school, they all went back home. Even the people like. Um, that I've made friends with that live here. They all went back home because their families live somewhere within France. But that's so weird, like not having like all my friends here and like my family. It's definitely just weird and I'm just like kind of bored more so. It's a very pretty place to be bored. I literally have the view of the Eiffel Tower and the Louvre, but it's just very weird. Like, <clears throat> And my, I FaceTimed my family like this morning, like really, really early in the morning. It was like 5 a.m. for me, but like 8 p.m. for them. And they were like doing their Christmas gift exchange. So it's nice to FaceTime them and talk to them. But that's yeah, really weird. I'm missing like all the snacky foods, like the cheeses and the meats and like cookies that my mom makes. And like, you know, all the snacky foods that you would have like at your, um, not at your Christmas dinner, but like your, your little like secondary dinner.
But yeah, I'm missing like the little snacky foods for sure. So one thing I've noticed with the blue and at Eiffel Tower is you see this man with like the purple ears and the green light. They'll flash it at people to try and get them enticed to like buy the light or whatever. I don't know. I think it's the light or maybe something at their stand. But he's not actually selling the things. He's, so he's doing that to people. And then he'll follow them and then see if they're interested. I've only ever seen it work once. And then he'll direct it to his friend where they're actually selling stuff. Because it's illegal to sell like the stuff on the street. And so this way they're just like, they can just run. So something that's interesting and definitely don't fall for it. Because it's definitely a scam. So yeah, but it's interesting. I just saw this. He did it to like a little girl and her mom and the mom got really mad at him so as she should okay so i'm home now i changed into some comfortable clothes and i'm gonna watch a christmas movie actually i don't know which one i normally just kind of go into netflix and then search up in the category of this holiday section and pick a random one that looks cute and cheesy um because that's what christmas movies are all about but my favorite christmas movie in general like off of the netflix original ones is um a christmas chron a christmas chronicles i think it's called and then like a princess switch and a christmas prince i love those ones they're so cheesy so good but anyways i'm gonna watch that but thanks for watching vlogmas um 2024 i that was actually a goal of mine to always do a vlogmas i've always wanted to do it so I'm glad I did it. I don't know if I'll do it next year or maybe I'll do like um, just each week. I will also vlog when my mom gets here later this week and then we're actually going away together. So there'll be a couple more vlogs coming from me um, this year and then I'm back for New Year's. So I'm so excited. I don't know what New Year's in Paris is going to look like. I've seen some like fireworks happening places. Someone said fireworks are at Tuileries Garden and I've seen them at the Arc and the Eiffel Tower. So I don't know, but it should be fun. And I hope you guys had a good Christmas to whoever who celebrates. And yeah, thank you for watching today's vlog.